Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Dawn and... Good morning, my name is Dave, how are we doing? And we've been up and out this morning at... I think when Kate left the house, gone six. It was, it was early. I don't think it was quite that early morning. Oh, okay. It was still dark, I got footage. We got there just before seven. Yeah, just before seven. So not many had set up actually. Um, Wait, get up. I punch up the look, 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 look what we're getting, harassed. As soon as we come in, look, this is what happened. Look, she won't leave us alone. Look at her, butter won't melt. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is the stuff we got from the car boot sale today. How much did you spend? I didn't spend that much. Oh, no. It's three pound I spent. Three pound I spent. Well, I spent a fiver on that, a pound on the other thing. Another couple of quid, you know, man. Is it? Six or seven, like seven or eight quid. Not much. There weren't much to buy there, were there? Not really. There wasn't actually. Um, so, there weren't many stalls there, but enough for us to get a few bits and pieces for eBay. Our eBay is going like crazy at the moment, isn't it, honey? Both our ones. Well, doing all right. We've got a few high prices. You sold something within an hour yesterday, which was like... He does a chicken dance. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was cute. Right, do you want to show you your first item? Because mine's all out there, so yep, I shall leave that day for a minute. I've got this little wooden baby's cot. I like wood stuff. How cute Needs is a bit that? Needs a clean. Yeah, that's got a name in it. Cute. I can see it on that. Oh, there you are, look. What does it sound like? Ray tell. <laughs> you guys can't see it right now, but Edie's like watching her daddy right now. What he's up to. Paid a pound for that. I think she wants to get in on the action. Look at her face. Aww. Need to clean up. That should be good. Oh, I'm still going. Yeah, Sold these before. Nice, strong rucksack. <laughs> Uh, old fashioned? <coughs> old fashioned. Oh look, it's got an old tag on it. Hang on. You can't see it. It's got it's another got thing here tag. as well somewhere. Yeah. Look. Alright. Anyway, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a rover, I think it says. It says airlines on that thing. Look. What's that say? Rover. Rover rucksack, it says on there. Rover rucksack. Paid a pound for that. Okay. Hopefully, 20, 25 quid I'm hoping on that. Ooh, so, ooh. that'll be good. Don't like to keep saying I'm actually going to get this stuff for really, I got this beautiful frame with cross stitch with a nice lace around it. I thought someone might love it as much as I do. Um, it was just sitting there at Nan's thing. I don't know. I might try and get £8 for it plus postage. Not sure, it's really pretty. What do you think? I've sold cross stitching before. Well, it's I might do, you really, never know. It's really, really lovely frame. It's not Dave's type of thing, so it's like. Does it look a bit faded there? No, like... no I checked it all. No, that's the colour of the actual all right. lace, honey. But it's all like that. Anyway, it's lovely. Well, no one bought this. I haven't looked it up Why or anything. Are you but no one's bought it because it's seized up and only wants soaking in oil, hopefully. I was going to pick that up. You got that off now, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, I was going to pick that up. That just, I don't think it really costs much, does it? You come with that with and, another, and some books. And I'm getting licked here. Bowl. <laughs> it's a funny video today, I think. <laughs> <laughs> we were... <laughs> oh, I've sold one of these before. We did briefly check it. It looks like someone stood on it. I hope not. Um, I've sold one of these for £8 before but doing? I might up the price because of it being near Christmas. There's loads of bits and pieces inside if you can see. So um, I'm going to try I'm gonna try 12 on that I think and plus postage on that one. This is like measly money, 20 odd p it would have cost me or something. So not too, not too shabby. <laughs> that would be one of our t-shirts. Dave's got himself a load of cookbooks. I like cookbooks. Patrick usually gives me them for nothing. So. so he's got cookbooks. 
I've only got a silver. She usually gives them out for free, doesn't she? Yeah. Oh, this big old jobby. And I don't pick this up, mouse trap. Some people were saying, oh, I don't really bother with things like that. But actually, I know that you can sell the parts for good money. That's so. a good box as well. And there was the instructions, which were in a different box. So I grabbed them for Dave to put with it. I think it's all there. It looks like it was all I there. I thought it was all there. It's, it's what, all neatly put in. The box is good. Now, I saw these last time at Nan's. So I picked them up again this time. And I'll go try to sell them. Little milk jug. Is it a milk jug you need to call that? Milk jug. But I've got two. I like the pattern on this one. And um, this one is a Arclo Honeystone made in Ireland Glenwood, Dave. You like stuff from made in Ireland, don't you? You never know you like. So that's that one. We'll get some more bits now. Is that my coffee? So I just got everything out of bags. So I picked, Dave actually saw these, so I picked these up because I have sold quite a few of these at the moment. Um, Sunday dishes, are they called? That do. But I haven't had ones with a big stem like that. There's seven in total. This only cost a pound for the lot, as well as other stuff that came with it. So they're really pretty. Um, it's the right time of year to sell these. They do need washing, which most things do, don't they? Um, so I've got to check them. All I did was grab them quick, because look, I've got one that's broken. Oh well. But they don't matter because they don't cost me that much. Even if I get a set of four, I'd be happy with that, including this little dish. I've sold these little trinket dishes, but never seen one with a little flower on. Um, usually I can sell these for about five each. Yes, all right, small money, but I haven't paid that much for these, and I'm happy with a fiver. I've just got a check, and I've just found there's a chip in there. So that will go out the charity shop, but I don't know. I also grab these little things. I don't know anything about them. But like Dave said, if they're not worth anything, he'll use them for like storage jars in his shed, including that one as well. I like that. I saw something a bit like this, didn't I? Which is, yes, you did, I yeah. like the fact it's got a plain name on there. Right. I'm trying to help you out, my dear. Hanging basket. Love these. I think these are really cute. Again, I might get five, six pounds for this, depending. I'll have to have a look on eBay, see if they're worth anything. I could just see a nice plant in there on someone's wall. Got us a UV40 tape. We love a UV40 in this house, though. CD, not tape. These are for me. You Do might you... try it on our sounds, sounds around. Yeah, it's cute. Little lace pillowcases for our downstairs little pillows little that I want to change. Because um, I've got butterflies on there, so I want to change it for these ones. So I like them. <coughs> then she had this. In there, I actually picked some decorations up for reselling next year, so just but in here is all these different little jewelries and stuff like vintage jewelry. Look, um, I just picked it up because I actually remember my mum having some like this. Um, I did like this, this is the main reason why I picked it up. I really like this, so I'm hoping I can get it to work for myself. I don't know, I really like it. So unusual unusual so yeah there's a ton of jewelry in there i just got to go for it i paid a pound for this and a load of other stuff so Maybe it Ooh, i just stood on the dog <laughs> she just stood right behind me right boring stuff now but it's my favorite thing to sell oh no hang on i'll just show you vintage forever friends drinking things i don't know how much if they're worth anything but um it's the right time of year to sell things like that. I don't think they've been used to be honest. I think they're um oh, I can't get the top off, but they're from 1990, so worth a try. Now the stuff I'm gonna show you is what really does sell for me at the moment, and that is vintage clothing. So a lot of these are from St. Michael's and some of these I've actually got the original St. Michael um coat hangers, I'm trying to think what it is. So I've got a beautiful, beautiful velvet dress like just like a topless velvet dress so I picked that one up um vintage style I don't know if this is a 90 because it's got pockets and that in I'm not sure size 20 to 22 again uh I do sell well with vintage stuff at the moment on the clothing front 
this i know i've sold quite a lot of this kind of stuff at the moment so that's why i've just quickly grabbed it i don't even know what i've got here so i've got vintage dressing pajamas so this one's size 12 to 20 12 to 20 get your tongue back indoor 12 to 14 saint michael's vintage satin like shimmy material so you've got the bottom and the top so i'll cra grab them quick beautiful detail on there i'm hoping to get i might try 15 on these um because they are gorgeous then another matching outfit from saint michael's again size 12 to 14 so here's the top pjs again bottoms again i will try exactly the same price these are actually brand new i don't think these are been worn. Ah, oh, hello, mate. Hello. Who's that? Captain Hook. And why do we call it Captain Hook Day? Because you've got a bent towel, you've you? got a bent towel, bless his heart. Are you kitchen, man? Gorgeous, isn't he? He looks like his daddy. Not you. He's <laughs> daddy, <laughs> daddy. <laughs> what are you doing? Say hi. Mm. What are you doing? He's having a little run around on Daddy's back. Say hello, YouTubers. <laughs> <laughs> hello, YouTubers. <laughs> they come out for a run. They like to you have a, run? a run during the day. So again, this is St. Michael's creamy colour um, satin things with matching top. So I'm really pleased with these because these are like in mint condition. I don't know if these are worth anything. At least we've got some vintage like vest things. I don't know if they're very small, aren't they? Um, I think these are size probably 12. I don't know, but they're St. Michael's. I checked them. There's one, two, three. Might get five for three. I've got to check them out. They're all different kind of things. So that I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know why I picked some nice hankies. I don't know if they're vintage, but I have got some hankies upstairs. So I might just do a bundle. And then some more St. Michael's items, a nice demo top, and a brand new with labels, St. Michael's velvet top there. And we've got another little guest. This is Robert. This is his brother. This is big Robert. And he's huge, guys. He's a very big boy. He's a beautiful boy, isn't he? Ain't ya? Yes, I am. <laughs> He's a bit more, well I was going to say he's a bit more well behaved but he's trying to get up there. Where are you going? Say hi. Hi everyone. He's gorgeous aren't you? Look at their lovely fur for winter. He knew you went boom at me. It don't hurt. He's a gorgeous boy. But they come out for a daily run. Hello. Hello baby. <laughs> Are you gorgeous? Are you gorgeous? You better get out of the way. I think they're in the way. You're not in the way, are they? You guys like seeing our little babies. If anyone don't know what they were and thinking, what the fuck were them furry things? The end of our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. It helps us very much. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram. We'll be uploading more videos. Um, I've still got my update sales to do. Because they're beautiful. Because they're beautiful. <laughs> um, and some real good ones coming up. I've got someone messaging me right now. They're waving at me at the moment. So, yeah. it's a, I do freebies, guys. And it's just someone that I know. Um, so, yeah. That's it. Hope you like the video. I will put the uh, little recording of us this morning in the dark <laughs> oh and it was great to see some of you guys that knew us as well that was awesome wasn't it H-O-A-D oh I can't remember don't ask me I'll put a bing there oh it's gone no, we, we found you we, we found, found you and we and both we subscribed to you <laughs> <laughs> and there was another guy as well but it was nice to meet somebody yeah. Thank you very much for saying hello we'll to us. It, that um, you talk to us that. We're always willing to talk to you guys if you're ever out and about and you see us, just stop us and we'll talk away. 
Because we that's what we like doing anyway. So yeah, thank you. Might not get rid of it, but Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. We better go now. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye. Bye. Early morning car boot and <laughs> it's pitch black. It's seven o'clock or just before seven o'clock. Not many here at the moment. A few are just sitting on the side waiting for it to get a bit lighter. Um, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about eight people here at the moment. Let's see.